Um, tell me about uh, there was the, the 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 Martin Lawrence Danny DeVito soundtrack. I forget the name of the movie. Yeah. Um, what's the worst that could happen? What's the worst that could happen? But it sparked your biggest solo hit because I remember being a kid and like I could not. Turn on the fucking radio oh, yeah, without yeah. hearing music. It was huge. It was everywhere. I, I, I couldn't believe it. I couldn't. I, to me, again, music was not supposed to leave my downstairs. That guy, my friend Bernard, he stole yeah. my CD. Crazy. I played it for him, and he stole it out my CD player. Then he went to California and went to a clear channel, um, the, the, the record convention. And then I'm sitting on the steps of the W... A lady comes down and says, yo, your song with Marvin Gaye is great. So now you can imagine me, Kev. I'm losing my mind. Like, what is she talking about? And who told her about this? Crazy. The whole convention had heard the record. Next thing you know, I go to Miami. I'm number one. I'm number one. And next thing you know, it just, whatever. Because the head of Clear Channel, I forgot his name was at the time, he, he loved it. And oh, that was it. It was a smash. And then Jimmy Iovine, of course, I worked with him before 95. Mm-hmm. He was like, um, for the soundtrack. Yeah. So the soundtrack was moving. But Clive Davis and Tommy Mottola was like, listen, what do, what do you want? So I went to Tommy Mottola and said, yo, $2 million, you know, whatever like that. But now I went to Clive. Clive said, I told Eric I give him $4 million and I give him half. As far as 50-50, me and him. He make money, I make money. Wow. That, that's how huge the song was. Was that because it, was, was there already a buzz for it before it like officially was like the buzz? Uh, yeah, because it happened in L.A. Okay, so, so everybody so, had already so heard the record already, and knew it. It, it was already being was, passed around. Was, in, was that was at the convention? Everybody that was at the convention. Yeah. it's Clear Channel. So it was. So then you have to worry about like okay, as long as y'all go get this cleared, because then you got to clear it. But that's what happened. Yeah, we, we got stuck up because it was a hundred fifty thousand dollars to the estate and then fifty thousand to the lawyer. So it cost two hundred to clear the record. Yep, to, for the Crazy. whole process. Such mm-hmm. a great record, though, man. Yeah. But, yeah. but it was worth it, two hundred, because it, it it gave me it gave me it gave me a career. It gave me another half of my life. Yeah, because then after that you have React and you all know, of it. Yeah. yeah, nobody nobody knew that I was going to come back with something like that afterwards. Because again, when something that big happens, they're like, "Oh no, that's it for him." And I came right back mm-hmm. with with that. Yeah, for sure, you man. Talk to me. Uh, Look at you, Kev. Kev, you know his shit. Go ahead, Kev. Yeah, no, I'm a hip hop fan, man. <laughs> um, 